good day in the bay and happy monday good morning boys and girls okay so our first project today is by zainab who and olivia who did a book on animals so every page is dedicated to a different animal the first one is polar bears so we have the illustration at the top and then all of the text at the bottom which includes fun facts and uh, and general information about the animal. So the kind of information you might see under a subheading like habitat or uh, diet. The next page is elephants. And again, it's organized it's the same way. And something super cute at the end that they did is give a little quiz so we have the illustration the fun facts and then a quiz to see if you're paying attention when you're reading that is always important to be asking yourself questions so that you're making sure that you understand what you're reading and at the end they have a little bit about the authors plus illustrations of themselves love the book well done girls now the next one is by Armand, who did a, a report, a little quick project on eclipses. So a solar eclipse uh, is when the sun and the moon are in line. And we're going to have a solar eclipse uh, next April. It's going to be a total eclipse, which means that the two are going to be right on top of each other, just like this going to be super interesting. So the moon will pass in front of the sun and what you'll see is uh, sort of like a darkness coming in front of the sun and then a glow from the sun behind it. It's going to be super cool. And now let's move on to our Wordle. All right, so here it is. All right. In the first word, there are two consonants. The first and last letters are vowels. They're the same vowel and they're the most common vowel. Okay, here we go, mystery number. All right, so this is kind of an interesting clue, so listen carefully. This number and this number are both odd not homonyms okay and they are the same numbers as these two numbers but in reverse these are the same numbers so this number is different than this number but they're both odd and neither one is a homonym but those numbers are the same as these two numbers, but in reverse. That means if you figure out these two, you've figured out those two in reverse. Now it's time for, well, before we get to the Mighty Come on the Day, I just want to let you know I'm so proud of all of you for how well you responded to the fire bell on Friday. So it was what we call a false alarm, but we did great, super duper well, and I'm super proud of you. I also want to remind you that we have our culture fair coming up next Monday. So if your parents are coming, make sure you bring home that flyer, or if they're not sure yet, bring home the flyer today and remind them. And now it's time for a Mighty Climb on the Day. Okay, I'll go da, da, da. So the Mighty Climb on the Day is a shout out to Lucas in our second grade, who during the uh, time we were outside on Friday noticed that somebody else was pretty cold and he had his jacket and guess what he did yep gave his jacket to the person who was cold and he said because you know what he was more cold than I was wow awesome well done that's what being kind is and anybody can do it why because you're a mighty mind not only that a mighty kind mighty mind Every day, boys and girls, it's a great day to get smart and be kind to both each other and the earth.
Let's have a wonderful day.